Hey everybody, welcome back to more Dark Souls 2 Blind with me. Um, we've got our poison rapier up to plus 8, uh, courtesy of a few handy titanite shard drops from uh, the skeletons in Harvest Valley. I didn't even know they could drop them, I just went to Harvest Valley to have a look around. Oh, I didn't realize that. Okay. But, um, the poison buildup on this weapon is pretty goddamn awesome now. Those R2s. They're so good. Unfortunately, it does use quite a lot of the weapon's durability. Because rapiers, you know, they're fragile swords. So against weapon uh, enemies like these that have no poise, it's better to just hit them with the single attacks, as I'm just realizing, until they get poisoned, rather than use a whole lot of R2s against them. Because the damage off the rapier, the base physical damage, is not good. Uh, we've been invaded by a grey spirit, so we'll see how this goes. Wherever he's at, he's probably spawned up over there. And I'd prefer him to be down here, but... Okay, it's officially a gank. Oh. Takasima has returned to their world. Brilliant. Come on, man. Wow. That phantom range. Oh, the, the joy jester is back, but it's not the joy that I know. Is he gonna die before we... Yep. <laughs> uh, I don't think I get souls from that, though. I only did 60 odd damage with the backstab. I... He, he might be wearing uh, the, the backstab ring that makes me not do extra damage on a backstab, which, you know, good on him. He sacrificed a ring slot for a very nice benefit while he was invading. That is generally why I wear the... the Jester's... Uh, why, why I was wearing the Jester's uh, chest piece. Because it was just, it was good for when I was doing the PvP. So it nullifies the, the backstabs. It was damn good. I mean, it, it looks kind of silly, but on my character, I think it looked alright. Just owing to the fact that it wasn't, you know, it didn't have really bright colours on it or anything. It was just sort of a dank brown yellow sort of colour. Oh, I think I did get souls for that. Whoa. Okay. So you know, not okay. What? I'm just, I'm bad at this game. I have, I always hold a direction when I use the R2 and it always just goes right off center. And you just miss them.
I'm an idiot. Right, we'll try this again. Thank God I didn't pop a human effigy or something. Okay, that was an interesting hit. By that I mean I don't think it hit me. Yeah. So they both dropped rusted coins. I don't know where your item find maxes out in this game, because it used to max out at 410, but I don't think there's even an item find stat that you can look at in the menu now. So I have no idea where that goes. But we gotta do this fast. hate these guys with their bows because they can shoot two shots really fast. Like that. But... If I am fairly far away... Can combo them. Emphasis on can. Bad at it. Sometimes you just need that stun lock potential, I think. And great Sword's not always good at that. It's good at stunning people when it hits, but... Yeah. So... I don't think I actually have to go through there. Whoa! Okay. He knows where I am. I've got to check if that bow, that second bow that I have, is actually, yeah, I have enough decks to use it now. And it's better than the other one, I think. They both have 65, but I think no, 65 plus 65. 65 plus 82. Yeah, okay, so this one, this one is marginally better. And I also bought... I found uh, where that wandering merchant is that was in um, No Man's Wharf. He was in Harvest Valley as well. I was looking around, checking in all the holes for uh, tight night shards and stuff. And he sells poison arrows. He only had 40 of them. But he sold them. So, naturally, I am going to poison the fuck out of these guys, if I can. Yep. So it takes four poison arrows, it means I can take out ten enemies like this. And I think... I really want to take out this one. Yep. And probably the one over there that's taken notice of me. But then again, there is a captain over there and another captain over there. Hmm. like a gauntlet. I'm about to die. I understand why you can't make the bow. Poison. Better just be unbalanced. 
I just thought maybe they'd left something unbalanced in the game. So I think I might have enough for everything here, and I'm sorry if you think this is a really cheesy way to take care of this area. Trust me, I pretty much agree with you. They do curve in midair. Not not a whole lot, but they do curve. This has actually hit my shield, like it should have. Is I don't like these dudes. I think I missed with that last one. Yeah. Otherwise I would have poisoned him by now. And he's dead. You can cheese the game with a bow. Probably gonna fast forward through this for you. Because I have no doubt this is really boring to watch. So as far as I know, this place is clear of enemies now. Oh, these guys dropped large Titanite shards, that's good. Ooh, Fire Drake stone. That's good. Alone Captain Armor. Didn't know they had a different armor piece. Oh, look at my massive shoulders. Sweet. That looks really cool, but 218, 280. Yeah, I like this old set anyway. So don't step on the buttons because the buttons create lava. And wow, is that a jump I don't want to make. Okay, let's time it when it stops. Alright. Large Titanite Shard, thank you. Monastery Charm, Large Soul of an Aimless Soldier. Seeing as I think this is a boss, I'm gonna use a human effigy. I'm gonna heal up. And. I can take off my bow. Let's get in there. Oh, it's not a boss. What's that message say? Be wary of left. Ah. Yes, hello. Are you going to see me at some point, or...? Do I have to throw things at you? Yeah, hi. There we go. 138. We call that less than impressive repose damage. Be wary of behind, yeah. Be wary of tight spot. Ah. So, do that. Fail at rolling backwards, yeah.
I don't know if he's poisoned or not. I think he is. Yeah, he is. There he goes. Large Titanite Shard. These guys are being real generous with those. I want to use the rapier in here anyway. What's this do? I don't... Ah. Okay. So it takes a while. Ah. <laughs> That's why it takes a while. Ooh. I thought I'd have to rely on my dodge rolling. I do. Please die. Thank you. Alright, and a life gem. Bonfire left. Fantastic news. Oh, spark plates. Oh shit, I didn't even see him. How did I not see you? I... I think I'm going to die. I died. Wow, that is... Is an interesting place for an enemy. I'm quite annoyed. <laughs> um, okay. Just bump my computer. Hope that didn't cause any technical issues. Alright, so I officially don't know how to handle this area. Jesus. Uh, Oh shit, that's gonna kill me. No. Alright though. Um. <laughs> I'm trying to think of how to handle this. Because, I mean, the, the knights I could probably... I don't know, the, the knights I could... Oh, hello. The knights I could probably take care of with the greatsword. That's fine. You can die. Yep. The knights I can take care of with the greatsword, but... I don't know about... This. There's, um... All the enemies on the, on the plates. Might cut, actually, to see, like, when we eventually get to the same place again. Might cut. Yay, invaded! We're de-invading. There he is.
No commentary, no gesture. I just want to get through this place. But the poison, it's useful for people who turtle behind their shields. It'd be good against me, I don't know what to do once I'm poisoned. It's a fuck ton of HP to lose, very fast. One, two. Okay, that went relatively hassle-free that time. I'm not sure if I like this bonfire very much. I don't know. This place kind of seems like it's full of dicks at the moment. Yep. Dicks. I wonder if they could make it through the flames. Anyway, I think if I just tried to run past. Oh, I mean, that, that practically killed him at right then. Running through the flames. So, a little bit of lion strats, just run past everything. I don't have to cheese everything with poison arrows, that's good news. So this guy is coming my way now. See, I don't have to use the R2s. I just like how fancy it looks. One dead. And I can drink my Estus, thank you. I was, mash I was mashing X for a little while there, and it just wasn't drinking. Alright, sir. One night in here. Dodge back. Perk. Dodge back. Perk. Dodge back. Oh god damn it, no. Please reconnect controller. Fucking controller. I swear to god. This wasn't happening when I was doing my my new game plus seven run. Now I'm kinda worried. Yeah. And a drink. This guy is dead. Ironclad leggings? Cool. I think this is designed actually so that you can get the aggro of the enemy after you run through. And that. And, well, not do anything apparently. Too many shits. Too many, too many shits. So, too many shots. Yeah. And R2. Okay, so this area is easier to handle than I thought. It's just trying to wait for them to die to poison is not always a viable strategy. Too caught up trying to cheese the game that I didn't realize there was an easier way. I don't know how these spike wall things activate. I don't really want to find out. Oh, okay. See. Small weapon, not so useful there. Big weapon, quite useful. 
People said left. Bonfire's left. I don't... Is there an item around here? No. Where's the bonfire? Look carefully be wary of lava. People said there were a bonfire. Where's the bonfire? ladder. Um. I don't... I don't like this. But there is a bonfire, so... Sweet. We have 34,000 souls. This is... Regions of lava and then lever required ahead. So I think you have to pull this. I don't know what it does. Did it just turn off all the traps? Oh, that's brilliant. Okay, I think the fog gate that we saw just before is going to be the boss, so I'm going to leave that for the next video. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you next time.